Uh, Jordan, so you're out here, uh, you know, watching you guys play. Um, you're on the roster, you're not playing. It's, uh, what's the point of being back out here again? I guess if you're just going to sit and watch. Uh, I, think I'm, uh, I think I'm a value, valuable piece in just helping the young guys. You know, I've been in their situation. You know, I've just, you know, I played with a lot of them in the D League and just giving them pointers on how the summer league going to be. I didn't play here several times, so just kind of letting them know how the game's going to be, trying to help them as best as I can. And then, you know, with being around basketball, only going to help me for the next season. So yeah. now, now for you, you have spent some time in the D League the last few years after yeah. bouncing around a little bit. I mean, what does a guy in your situation learn from, from being down and playing in, the, in the, those, those games? Oh, uh, you learn a lot of things. I mean, me, I'm a self observer, you know, so I observed my, you know, my situation, how I did things, you know, while I was out of the league and I just, you know, kind of added them to me while I was on the journey of getting back, you know, it, it allowed me to, you know, just be appreciative of little things, taking advantage of opportunities and things like that. I think for you, if, if I'm wrong, correct me, but your last game before heading over to China, I think you dropped like 41 points or something like that, yeah, right? Yeah. What was it like having a, you know, to end a season on that note? And then to not get picked up with an NBA team after that? I mean, it was a surprise, but it was also my first time, you know, in free agency. So I also didn't know really how it worked. I didn't really communicate with my agent and, you know, me being in more control. So it was a lot of, you know, learning things that I that I took with me that now I can be more in control of. So now that you're looking to get back in, I know your contract's not guaranteed next year, but you'd love to play. What do you pick up from that, that experience playing in China? Overseas, does it humble you? I mean, is there things you learn over there that you can take back to the NBA when you get back in? Oh, I learned things. You know, me, me, you know, being over in China, I didn't. It wasn't really a basketball thing. I learned, you know, a lot of life things and me growing as a person, and it allowed me to, you know, become a better player. So, you know, I, I, each year, I, you know, I get older, I want to get better in life, and then that translates onto the basketball floor. Now you're here to pass that knowledge down to the youngsters, right? No doubt.